Hello everyone and welcome to your weekly gambling news roundup. The news this week, as always, brought to you by PlaySlotsForRealMoney.com. That's the numeral four. And EasyMobileCasino.com. Subscribe to our newsletter to get the latest news and bonus code delivered to you weekly. For the most recent online casino ratings and slot machine reviews, stop by CasinoSlotsMoney.com. For Bitcoin and other cryptocurrency quotes, stop by ArmyOfBitcoin.com. Please take a moment to give this podcast a five-star rating on whatever podcast platform you're on. It really does mean a lot to us, and it's so easy to rate and review us. Also, feel free to view the links below, which are always helpful resources. Well, in our first story this week, sports betting in Connecticut is finally set for a launch. After receiving approval from the Department of Consumer Protection, local casino operators should start taking bets very soon. The agency has granted licenses for tribal-owned casinos Foxwoods and Mohegan Sun, as well as the Connecticut State Lottery. The Mashantucket Pico Tribal Nation, which operates Foxwoods Resort Casino, has partnered with DraftKings and announced that the sports wagering in their casino will start on Thursday. Mohegan Tribe is still quiet on their plans, while the State Lottery should roll out its betting operation in a few stages during the month of October. For now though, betting will only be available on-site at the casinos, while online wagering should be possible by the end of the month. Next up, a police raid on an illegal gambling establishment in Daly City, California leads to four arrests. Last Thursday, Daly City Police Department busted an illegal gambling operation set up at a home on Monterey Avenue. Acting on previously acquired information, the police served a search warrant at a facility hosting illegal coin-operated slot machines. During the action, they also seized several firearms, illegal drugs, and an undisclosed amount of money. The raid was conducted by the DCPD Crime Suppression Unit with the support of the department's detective and tactical team. Four adults were arrested and taken to the county jail. Currently, they are facing charges related to illegal gambling, guns, and drugs. The police department has released no further details at this time. In our next story, a Caesars Palace dealer takes the first prize at a special 2021 WSOP event. Like every year, the World Series of Poker held a special event last week, pitting casino employees against each other at the poker table. Jimmy Barnett, who works as a dealer at Caesars in Vegas, came out the winner and took home the $39,013 top prize. Barnett also received his first WSOP gold bracelet. A California native, Barnett moved to Vegas three years ago and, per his words, has dreamt of this moment ever since. On his road to victory, he outlasted 419 competitors, including 13 players at the final table. The winner dedicated this great success to his late grandmother, who passed away just three weeks ago. In our last story this week, El Salvador is all in on Bitcoin. The Central American country led by tech-savvy President Nayib Bukele has just started mining the most popular cryptocurrency using the energy from the volcanoes. So far, using the geothermal power harnessed from the volcano, the country has mined $269 worth of Bitcoin. The process is still in a test and trial phase and Bukele expects that it will allow the country to mine Bitcoin with cheap and 100% clean and renewable energy. Volcano-powered Bitcoin mining is, of course, nothing new. Iceland, for example, has been doing it since the very beginning of crypto mining. El Salvador has an abundance of geothermal resources and the country is often called the land of the volcanoes. Well, as always, remember to visit PlaySlotsForRealMoney.com, that's the numeral four, and EasyMobileCasino.com. Subscribe to our newsletter to get the latest news and bonus codes delivered to you weekly for more updates. Share this podcast on social networks and remember, for the most recent online casino ratings and slot machine reviews, stop by CasinoSlotsMoney.com. For Bitcoin and other cryptocurrency quotes, stop by ArmyOfBitcoin.com. Feel free to view the links below which are helpful resources. Well, that is your weekly gambling news roundup for this week. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.